the past that I don't need a mentor. No, no. I think that the thing we have the mentor means um, they will not be free to do what they want to do because many youths, many people don't like being accountable to somebody. Yeah. So having a mentor make them feel that like, oh, this person will monitor me. I don't want to be monitored. I don't want to be controlled. Let me just live my life the way I want it. So I think that's the reason many many youths don't want to have mentors again. Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to my channel. Guys, this is your first time on this channel. Do not forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon so that you'll be the first to know when I drop new videos. So, I have with me a guest, <laughs> and her name is Anini. Okay, so, um, what do you do? I'm a student, I'm also an entrepreneur, I sell oil perfumes, and I'm also a digital marketer. Okay, that's great. So, I'll be asking her a couple of questions on mentorship. So, you think mentorship is very important okay why i think mentorship is important is that um i always have this notion i always believe that anywhere you want to reach in life someone has gotten there before you someone has been there so and there's no way you, you can go there without the person's guide so you need someone that has more experience than you someone that is more has more experience in life than you so you need them to guide you in the steps you'll be making because as growing up growing up as youth there are plenty of opportunities to there are many opportunities in front of us and in order not to make any mistake, you have you need a mentor to guide you. You need a mentor. Okay, so we do things are going today now. Do you think that youth of use youth of these days still pay attention to mentorship? No, I don't think so. Like from what I've right. observed because is that many youths don't pay, atten pay attention to mentorship because they think it's something of the past that I don't need a mentor. No, no, they think that they think we have the mentor means um, they will not be free to do what they want to do because many youths, many people don't like being accountable to somebody. Yeah. So having a mentor will make them feel that like, oh, this person will monitor me. I don't want to be monitored. I don't want to be controlled. Let me just live my life the way I want it. So I think that's the reason many, many youths don't want to have mentors again. Okay, so if someone wants to get one, like how do you advise the person? If you want to get a mentor, yeah. first of all, you have to find someone that um, has the same interest as you have, someone that is like-minded with you. Because, for example, I can't be a tech person and look for a mentor in the fashion industry. It's actually contrasting. You have to actually look for someone that is in the same field as you. You have to look for someone that speaks your own language, understands you, understands your language. So, to so find a mentor, you have to find someone that understands your perspective, that has the same interest as you have, that understands your language, and also someone that's accessible. Because you have I mean to say this person is my mentor, this person is my mentor, but they don't even know you. No one doesn't about having yeah. online mentors yeah. or imaginary mentors. Yeah. They have to know someone that's accessible that, that even if you need an advice or you need a counsel concerning something any time of the day, you can easily call the person, chat the person up, or you can even schedule an appointment with the person. So you need to find someone that's accessible. Alright, so yeah. what is the difference between a role model and a mentor? Because some people would would um, say that um Two Face is my mentor, but they have never seen seen him before. They have never Two Face don't know don't know them. So what's the difference between a role model and a mentor? Okay, the difference between a role model and a mentor. A role model is someone that you are actually looking up to, someone you would love to be like. Okay. While a mentor is someone that will just guide you through the processes of maybe getting there. For example, using that same example you gave, Two Face being a mentor or a role model. Two Face can be a person's role model. You know, you may want to sing like him or reach the, um, his level in, the, in musical mm -hmm. career, but you actually need a mentor that will groom you to reaching that level that Two Face has reached. So that's the difference between a role model and a mentor. All right. So who are your mentors? Okay, I actually have one basic mentor. One like my main mentor. My mentor, his name is Mr. Ferdinand Achado. Uh, he has like I actually met him. I actually got to know him very well, 2020 December, and since then, like he, ha he has really, really blessed my life and impacted my life. No small time at all. That's my mentor, Mr. Ferdinand Achado. That's his name. So, who are your um, role models? Okay, my role models. Yeah. Um, I'll take Dr. Paul Eneche and Dr. Mrs. Becky Eneche. Also, Deborah Paul Eneche. I love her so much. I love her dress sense. Her, I have her, her dress sense. I love it so much. Also, I love. Um, there's okay. Yes, I also love um, Bishop David Oyedepo and also um, Ben Carson. Ben Carson. Yes, yeah, yeah. so I've yeah, I've heard of him. I've read about him a lot, and yeah. it inspires me big time. In the fact that he was he's not he didn't just arrive where he was yeah. just all of a sudden. He went through processes and yeah. trainings and stages of his life, and he was still somebody at the end. So, so that people actually look up to. Yeah, Ben Carson was was the person that made me to like books mm. because. There's a book he wrote that he the, the first book I read of him was um, I think Gifted Hands yeah oh, oh, oh. 
that was the first book I read, and the book it talked a lot about his story, how he, how he went from being so dull in school to being a very bright student and all that. So him seeing him achieve that, you know, made me believe that it's also possible for me too. So I think he's I think he's a very good person, you know. Mm-hmm. He's, yes. yeah, he's a very good person. So um I think that's all. So for me, I was I'll say that I agree with everything you said. You know, mentorship is very important. No matter how big you are, or no matter how big you are going to get, there is always so, there is always someone that has done that has been there before you. Exactly. And mentorship is like a shortcut. Mm-hmm. You, you understand? Mm-hmm. So if you have done something before and I want to do it, I can get inspiration from you. Like I can get some idea from you on how on how it was for you. Even though how it even though how things were then might not be how it it was now but i can get some insight and some guidance from you and i won't have to repeat the same mistakes that, that you've made you are advising youth out there to get mentors and get people that they can look up to and also ask questions yes. about their life so guys there you have it thank you for watching this video if you loved it comment your thoughts subscribe to the channel do you have a channel <laughs> do you plan know. to get one soon um not really not really <laughs> okay i wanted to say subscribe to our channel but i really just um but they can um, contact you on facebook and instagram okay so so um what's your username on facebook or instagram okay on instagram. facebook um my username is onye valerie then on instagram is only only social okay yes. so i'm um, i'll put it on the screen so that they can check you out and follow you up so guys thanks for watching subscribe and comment and i'll see you guys in the next video